Hello friends, we are here at Dollar Tree and they have these really cute tins and these are actually in the shape of um, the little trailer and you have like the cute wreath and then you have the gingerbread man with the hot cocoa and the candy cane and all that fun stuff. Comes in two sizes from what I'm seeing. This one's the large, this one's the small. These are both really cute treat, treat containers. They also have the um, Christmas trees and again I'll show you the size difference. Right there, that's the size difference. So love the ornaments on the side again it says um happy happy holidays really cute for gift giving and there's a i think there's um i know there is one i'm on the hunt for it there is a gingerbread man one as well and here is the santa claus these are all a dollar of course i know we all know about the increases that are coming but as far as i'm seeing everything is still a dollar and this is a penguin. Maybe they sold out of the gingerbread because the gingerbread man would, I mean, that's, those are so cute. But I am seeing still a lot of these and these are adorable. These are so cute. These are cute as decor or they're cute for giving, a, you know, baked goods in. They're just adorable, period. Let me see. Yeah, I like this. Love it for decor. And the side is so stinking cute. I have these, and this is considered an ornament. Merry Christmas. These are from back from last year, but these are cute as well. And you can use them as signs and so forth, however you want to put them to use. Here are more gnomes. I'm telling you, I'm like the gnome whisperer. This happened to me last year. I found all the gnomes. Anyways, more gnomes. This really cute reindeer in the silver and the gold. This would be cool for a wreath. And they have it in the red. And I wanted to show you, I wish they would have brought this out. Maybe I didn't see it. I don't know. But I, oh no, I did see this. The Happy Halloween in the tinsel. Yeah, that's adorable. I like the boo too with the tinsel for Halloween. I think those are cute as well. Hoping I would run into these and I did. Yay. I only found two of them, but that's good enough. LED light set in the red and white. How cool are those? Hopefully I'll find more. I know I will in my adventures, but I this is awesome. Really, really liking these. So this is a good find. Definitely want to pick up on these. And then, of course, there's the flashing lights, the light tree toppers. And again, I mean, I told you guys my ideas on those. So I think these are a great deal. Here you have also the LED light sets in red. And this one is in yellow. Right, so I'm seeing a lot of red. I'm seeing some yellow and I'm seeing some clear white. They also have the candy cane wreath and the snowman and lots of bells. Big ones in silver, green, gold, red. And oh my god, I love these poinsettias. I think they're so beautiful. All right, we also have stencils, season's greetings. Hold on. All right, season's greetings. And there's a red one back. So is this all there is, season's greetings? Yeah. All right, honestly, like another must have are these. Look at, they're already going. Jeez, this, okay, so everything that's left is like what nobody wanted is all broken up. Yeah, those are really, really popular for DIYs, but they're like missing bows. Here's the one that goes to the red, but it's missing like the little holder. And I already showed you guys these. These are adorable too. The ribbon. Really, really nice. All right. Oh, they're also bringing in these. You can make your own ornament as well. And then these bulbs as well. These are plastic. That's too bad. Oh, yeah. See, they're all broken. That's too bad. Maybe we'll find some more in the other crafter square. Okay. Here's more lights. These are LED, like, little... Oh, okay. They're like little wisps. That's cool. You can see them right there. And then look at these, the Christmas trees. Okay, I'm seeing green and like this burgundy. That's pretty. And then they also have the silver and the the matte silver and the matte gold, the deer. 
And those are really cute. Those little trees, those tea light candle holder trees. All right, it is really scary how fast stuff is going. All right, I showed these in my haul. I've already hauled these. Here they are again. There's like, there's a couple left. And these are lights as well in the gold. And then here is the red and white, like the candy stripe look. And these are so cute. I don't know how I'm gonna use them, but I'll figure out a way. Let me see, there's two. I think I'll get another one, get three. Oops. All right, this one's already open, so let me see the texture. Can you move them? Yeah, you can bend them, you can move them. All right, that's cool, I like those. I'm glad I found those, because that was like on my wish list. I still have more flower makeup, and this looks like it is Pop Fanatic Eye Pigment. And this comes, it's, it's in Wham, so that's pretty cool. And they have this, what is this? All Brow Mascara. Brow Master. Oh, okay. Eyebrow Chubby, so that's to put like, your, it's eye for eyebrows, obviously. Let's see, they have the different ones. They have light medium light medium okay and then this is eyeshadow yep all right what is this um hard candy glamouflage all right this one's falling out let's see these are falling out are they supposed to be falling out i don't think so all right so this is eyeshadow Ooh. LA Colors Glossy Jam and Jelly. I like that. That'd be fun. Here's another eyeshadow by LA Colors. This is coffee. Alright, so I'm not really that impressed with the flowers. This is this is glamouflage. This is gonna be in like a deep. What is this called? Love. And then again, you can see the breakage. So you gotta really be careful about what you're putting on. Um, this looks really cool. This is called On the Taupe of the World. Ha ha ha. So it's taupe. I'm not into the eyeshadow chubbies, but that's just me. I'm a very bizarre person. All right. Let's see, is there anything else interesting? Nah, probably all sold out. Again, there's a lot of the flower foundation. Also elf. So yeah, not too bad finds going on here at Dollar Tree. All right, we're gonna start seeing a lot of this come through, and this is cute to include, like if you're giving like a making like a little basket, or if you want to include it with your mugs, or include this like with a big treat container. I mean, or if you just want them in your house to snack on, you know they're good. My husband can eat a whole bag by himself. I also like these for stocking stuffers or mug stuffers because you get four for a dollar and these are good. They're shortbread cookies. Yummy. All right, so we're going to take a look at the mugs and they were nice enough to bring out a box to let me look at. So very, very sweet of them. Okay. Hold on, you guys. I got to get in here. All right, this is a really cute one. This is style is the cute camper with Santa Claus. And what's cool is it already has the to and from tag, which is really nice and convenient. And I do like the packaging. I think it's totally adorable. And for a dollar, I mean, seriously, you can't, it's, how can you go wrong? And if you have a lot of people like you need to give presents to, you can always just fill these up with like individual peppermints. They sell them, you know, by um, the value packs. You know, you can just put in like a ton of peppermints or those tiny little candy canes. And then you can just put, open this up, pour in like the individual wrapped candies and put this back over, box it up again and just put to and from. Or if you want to put to and from and then put like maybe a little cute bow on the side, you could do that and you're done. So definitely, you know, you can do presents for under for a dollar and like 50 cents and they also have this one that has like all the buzzwords have a merry christmas ho 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 merry and bright 
and again um, there's some type of design on the back I can't see it I'm not gonna unbox this but it looks like there's a present and you have the snowflakes you have the holly you have the candy cane really really cute and I'm gonna go through this and we'll see what else is in here and it's the most wonderful time of the year with the Cardinal is that not cute so all right so we have the camper we have its most wonderful time of the year with the Cardinal and then we also have the buzzwords down there so that's three designs that I'm seeing so here they all are I think this is the three designs there might be a fourth so I'm gonna look really quick all right there's more cute ones look at this this is Frosty the snowman and the box is already tweaked so I don't really want to get mad and think I did this because I didn't as a matter of fact I'm gonna fix it <laughs> um, That's it says ho 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 with the snowflakes. And this could totally, I mean, this is so cute. It really is. All right, then they also have the Santa belt. So these are the four different ones that I'm seeing. And I'm pretty sure probably four designs is all that comes in here. Yeah, the buzzwords. There we go. Put that one back. These are so cute. And I'm sure there's going to be gnome ones. I was looking for a gnome one, but I'm not seeing it yet. So it's probably just not in this box. Well, that was fun. That was really fun to see, and it was very nice of them to pull out a box for us. A lot of you may be asking, how did I get them to pull out a box for us? Um, I made friends with the manager, and she's very sweet and just very nice, and she said that she would let me know when the mugs came in, and she did. So it's it's just really important that you form, you know, um, I don't want to say friendships, but that you're cordial with the employees and the managers because they're very nice, you know? All right, here's terrariums, and you can put a little succulent in there, or you can make a um, DIY ornament. That would be cool, too. So, just another idea. How cute are these signs at Dollar Tree? Total farmhouse. Believe in the magic of Christmas. Love the matte white beading. A dollar. Good tidings of comfort and joy. How cute. Again, farmhouse with the beading. Believe in the magic of Christmas. How cute are these? For a dollar a piece and they are a really nice size as well so these are super cute you guys and then look home for the holidays with a little burlap banner with the red truck and then look at the season's greetings with the you know what I gotta pull that out hold on it's the lighting hold on all right here we go home for the holidays and it has the cute little like burlap banner and home for that is written in um, red glitter and then you have like the whole background of the log cabin the Christmas trees all that cuteness and then look at this one you have the whole village and it says seasons greetings it's missing the S right there but you have a little banner and then you have the cute village that's so cute and again these are what I call fillers and I'll show you what I mean fillers and how I used these type of signs to fill in like certain awkward spaces because I have really limited space to work with so this these type of signs really come in handy for me and look they have the red and black buffalo check mats and these are amazing I mean it's even yeah you definitely need these and you need to get them now when you see them okay trust me all right we're gonna look at how cute these dang cards are they're stinking cute you guys they have look at this merry little christmas with the mason jar and the red and black buffalo check perfect for framing for my friend look at the cup of hot chocolate totally cute the gingerbread house and the gingerbread woman how cute Sorry about that glare. There you go. And look at this, the gnome. Of course, merry and bright. How cute is this stuff? Merry Christmas with the presents in the truck. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this embellishment. All right, we're just gonna get right into it. Look at how cute. Look at how adorable. All right, I'm gonna come back up to a wonderful daughter. How cute. 
Oh my gosh, this would be perfect to frame. Perfect. I get so excited because it's just so fun, you know? Like, seriously. Alright, let's see what else is going on. The mittens. All is calm, all is bright. Mom, because you mean so much to me. Look how cute this is. I should get my husband this for my amazing husband. I think I'm gonna get this for him now. Oh, but I like this, you guys. I think I wanna frame this. <gasps> it's all too cute. I get I don't know what to do with myself, seriously. Look at all this. Joy. Oh, too cute. Look how cute these gnome picks are. Look at how adorable his hat is. The green, the red and white. This, ugh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. And they have the gray with the um, little snowflake. Totally cute. And you guys, you have to get this stuff now. So I'm gonna get a couple because I wanna put these, um, these are gonna go somewhere around my house. I really, like the green and red ones so i'm gonna get a couple of those to stick around totally cute how adorable love it love it love it love it so fun and then these are the poinsettia ones that i was talking about that are very similar to the ones at hobby lobby so the ones at hobby lobby are 449 so this is definitely a great deal and I cannot stress enough how great of a deal these big bells are. I mean, everything in the crafting section, you know, now I see what the big deal is, like why everyone loves the stuff at Hobby Lobby. I mean, um, here. DIY ornament kit. So I wanted to get something for my nephew to make, but something like simple, you know? He's just, just a little guy. All right, let's take a look at these. Look at the, oh, how pretty against the black, the candy cane and the holly. Oh, look at the black and white buffalo check. Look at all this, the gnomes. Oh my gosh, you guys, this stuff is so cute. Just fun, you know? And that's what it's about, fun. And these are awesome for starting your gift baskets with baking spirits bright with the cute um, little gingerbread and the hot chocolate and the mints and the sugar cookies. They have that and then they also have, all right, so they have those. I was trying to see if there's anything in between, but no. And then they also have the fresh cut trees. So these are totally cute. Again, perfect for starting your baskets your gift baskets totally totally cute or I might put my wax melts in here I don't know I'm trying to look for one that's not damaged because you guys know how I am I'm like super anal about that stuff so hold on all right this one looks pretty good for a dollar yeah and I almost missed these because I'm so excited about everything else totally cute how cute are these? Two for a dollar. The gingerbread man and the stinking, the ornaments. And the candy cane. The gnome and the candy cane. Yes, please and thank you. The elf and the candy cane. Yes, please. The penguin and Santa Claus. I'll take them because they all match. That is amazing. And what's cool is you can use this on your tiered trays. Or um, you can put it, you can tie it to a mug. You can use it um, on your, I mean, anyway. There's so many different things. Speaking of tying stuff to mugs, look at these cute initials. S, A, look at that. Can we get a Q? No, we never can get a Q. But I mean, these are cute too. Again, if you know your daughter's name is Samantha, put this on her gift or put it on her mug. You know, I mean, so much fun stuff, you guys. And look at the elf legs. How cute is this? If you're gonna be doing an elf tree, how groovy, honestly, really. So stinking cute. 
All right, I'm trying to think if I have enough of these because I'm going to do one of my trees with these ornaments. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's twenty-four. That would decorate the tree, but I'm going to need a couple more. I think I'm going to take just two more. Because I think I'm going to do my iridescent tree in my living room with this stuff. Which means I need to find a topper that matches. This is going to be so cute. But I also want the option. I need these like. I want some of these for my bar. And this will do. This, this should get my tree. And then. I need a couple of these for my kitchen. And I want to hang one of these. I want to tie one of these to that um, Santa's helper, the Ray Dunn. That would look so cute, the candy cane or the um, gingerbread man. All right, how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to spend some money here, but that's okay. That's okay. All right, and I am the gnome whisperer. Here we have the gnome. More gnomes. <laughs> All right, here's the candy canes, and these are cute for wreaths. Cute for wreaths. Yep. Oh my god, guys, I'm so excited. I found those. That is like a cha-ching find. All right, look at these beautiful ornaments. The churches in the Christmas plaid, the green Christmas plaid, the red and blue Christmas plaid. So pretty. Wow. I'm so glad we came. I mean, because these would be gone. I'm sorry. I mean, if someone's going to get mad at me in the comment section, because I, I didn't clear the shelf, but I took what I needed. But if I didn't do it, someone else would. And that's a for cheesy. Okay. I like this elf. You know, I've been thinking that I want some of this for outside. And I'm not big on tinsel. So I'm like, kind of like, should I get it or should I not, you know? I don't want to think about it too hard because look, it's already going. Like I could hang this outside. I think I'm gonna take, oh no, I'm already gonna spend a lot of money right now. These little guys, you have the little Santa Claus. Is he a monkey? I don't know what he is, but he's a plushie. All right, this looks like a snowman. Or is he a penguin? I don't know. Anyways, these are cute for the kids. And I've already showed you guys the elves before. But there's more. Lots of them. I say a lot of elves. I mean a lot of them. So there's a lot of elves, as you can see. I also have these. Believe in the magic of Christmas. Merry Christmas. And that looks like those are the two. Oh my gosh, look at the socks. Fala la llama, cute. Santa Claus. The penguins. Merry and magical, the unicorn. The flamingos. The Dotsons. Ah, just fun, you guys. Fun, fun, fun. I already showed you guys those, but I wonder if I should include a DIY craft for my nephew. Hold on, everyone. This pom pom trim, they have it in white, green, and red. This stuff is going to go by. This, I mean, people are going to buy this up. All right, they also have these. Our family works, plays, and loves together in the black and white. Very farmhouse, very cute. And then they also have home sweet home. And I'm seeing more. My house, my family, my life. Fair enough. If not now, when? Okay, I've showed you guys this one. 
All right, let's keep going. That was a lot of fun Christmas stuff, you guys. I just, like, flipped my lid. I mean, I just can't. I'm sorry. These things are just, like... This is stuff we're seeing at Hobby Lobby, except two for a dollar. So that is just too cool for school. All right, let's check out the rest of what's going on, and let's see. Cute stickers. Lucky. Happy. All right, this looks like it is iron-on transfers, sparkle and shine. Adventure awaits, so you can make your own t-shirts. Why not, right? Girl power. Keep looking up. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Please don't make me stay at this. Hold on, you guys. All right, they also have, but first, coffee. And these are iron-on transfers. How stinking cute are these? Then you have glass stickers, and it says, You, me, love, kiss, perfect for Valentine's Day. And look at these. The butterfly. You know what? The, you guys are getting the... I'm sorry about that glare. All right, this is nautical. Yeah, it's the, you know, it's the glare. I'm so sorry. As you can see, these designs, glass stickers, because it's more of a pattern. Look at that glass sticker. Summer. Yep. Can we get through Christmas before we start going through summer? <laughs> we just left summer. Ooh, look at the unicorn. Very pretty. Laser cut craft icons, the butterflies, the stars, the owls. Really, this is so cute. I know I should take pictures of this, but I'm tired. Maybe I'll just do a screen grab. Because this one's cute, too. Rowl, this is always good to stick in a mug. Bliss, be blissful, be peaceful, vibrant. Can't go wrong with Purell. Look, great for stocking stuffers. Maybelline, medium. Color correcting kit. Wow. Look at that. By Maybelline, ladies and gents. Look at these Ioni lashes. I should get some. You know, instead of paying $25 for Max, I'm going to get my makeup done. I think I'm going to. I'm pretty sure I have thick ones, but I don't want to. What's the difference between? This is handmade. Are these the same? Wispy Dramatic Flare. Oh, this is Wispy. I don't know what that. Cat Eye. These are cute. You know, I'm just gonna get both. Uh, make up my mind later. Alright, I'm gonna get one of these. Let's see. Corrector, concealer, highlighter. I think I'm gonna go with this. Maybelline? Yeah. Of course. Alright, let's see what else. I'm looking for name brand makeup right now, so. All right, looks like they got in Maybelline, but we saw a lot of cool stuff yesterday at the other store, so that was a hit, too. More cute socks, get the little doggies. More doggies, the penguins, the snowman. The flamingo, the reindeer. The gnome. Oh. Oh my god, these are crew socks. These are adorable. Oh, how cute. The penguin. The bear. Perfect for gifts. Especially this little guy. I have the polo, Beverly Hills polo socks are back with the llamas. Two pairs. Perfect for Christmas, you guys. Don't miss out. Look at all that. Name brand. More of the polo with the um, unicorn. Really, really cute stuff. Nice. 
All right, so we found a lot of cool stuff and a lot of new finds, and I'm going to end it here. As always, have a great day or a great evening, and I'll see you all later. Thank you so very much.